What's going on YouTube? It's one of Supreme again and welcome back to some more Star Citizen. Um I I have no words right now. I have no words. This is a ship that I have been dying to fly and dying to use. And I was gonna wait to grind it out until after the wipe. Because it's not in the pledge store. Or it's not available on the pledge store as of right now. But I went to uh, go rent a ship in Lorville. And I saw this on the ship rentals. And I... I was like a little kid on Christmas. I'm like, no way. But this is the Aegis Vanguard warden I have been dying to fly this ship like I said because of the the just sheer firepower the pilot can control it is classed as a heavy fighter and it lives up to that um, I don't remember what size those, uh, I think they're proprietary cannons. I'm not 100% sure. They're basically weapons exclusive to the Vanguard series. And I believe, on a nose, it, it does not have a size 5. You can, it's got, it's got a size 5 hard point, but it's got a gimbaled size 4 on it, I believe. I am in awe of this ship. I flew it around a little bit. I did a VHRT in it. <clears throat> and I fell in love. This is going to be when I'm able to officially buy it myself. Because I'm not going to grind it out right now because of the wipe coming up. Um, when I'm able to grind this thing out or it becomes available in the pledge store. This will end up being my daily driver. This ship is... I see why people love this ship. I really do. I mean, it's just got a mean stance to it. Plus the glow from those vents. They're fucking insane. And it's, it's just... I'm speechless when I look at this fucking thing. I've shot down many of them. And I'm always like, yeah, give that shit to me. All right? But here, let's look at the, uh, actually, I don't know if I can pull it up right now. I cannot. But. <laughs> it's speechless. It does normally have missiles down there, but I launched all my missiles. And for some reason, they, I, I run into, the, this is the main bug I run into. Missiles not, uh, refilling even after I pay for them. It'll eat my money, but I don't get my missiles back. Yeah, this is the Aegis Vanguard Warden. Oh, man. Let's just, you know what? Let's just skip right into it. And get into it. By the way, before we start anything, I wanted to point out, if you guys are enjoying these videos, uh, go ahead, please leave a like and hit that subscribe button for more. All that will help me out so much, and it motivates me to do more videos. What the f God damn it. This fucking ramp, I swear. Also, if you want to see more Star Citizen content, other than just VHRTs and shit like that, um, let me know in the comments down below. Let me know what you want, guys want to see, and I will uh, make that happen for you guys. But... I want to point this out. Another reason why it's my daily it would be my daily daily flyer. I got a bed to log out in. And got a little bathroom. Oh, I'm not. And yeah, we got a toilet to take space poops. <laughs> I'm more excited about that than I should be.
Oh. And honestly, this view is awesome. Okay, so it's got... Um, I don't know if that's a Roman numeral, but it's either an M5 or a MVSA. It's got four of them, uh, proprietary laser cannons, and the nose, and it's got a size 4 re uh, Revenant ballistic uh, Gatling on the nose. But when I get mine, that is going to have a fixed size 5, uh, probably a laser cannon on it. I'm going to put repeaters in the nose, and then I want to put the size 5 laser cannon underneath. Oh man. Here, let's uh... I love the cockpit layout for this. I really do. Alright, we're gonna throw targets here. We will throw comms here, but actually before we do that... Um... Change all my weapon groupings. And then... Yep, comms. Power, power. And... Shields. Go shields up. Grab me a... I'll do a single VHRT for this one. Grab my call to arms. Oh, call to arms isn't there for some reason. Whatever, it's not that big of a deal. And... Let's set off, shall we? Ah, oh, just look at this thing. I used to... Before... When I first saw these ships, I used to be like, eh, you know, it kind of, I was like, nah, I don't see the, I don't see the love for it, right, and then I started seeing more and more on it, and I started looking at it more, I'm like, fuck, this ship actually looks good. We'll take off here a little bit. Let's fly out of the hangar. We don't want any mishaps. And landing gear up, wings come out. Fuck, man. It's just, it's so good looking. Like, just look at that mean, like, it's got a dark stance with those fuck and the glow from the vents. Oh, man. It just looks good. I think this might be an atmosphere. I also want to point out, after my le previous video, after revisiting the uh, the Anvil Arrow, I have officially retired the Gladius. I melted my Gladius because I'm I'm ready to move to the Arrow. And I think it's going to be my main workhorse now. Because I honestly felt like I melted that bounty, or those bounties, in that previous video. But when I get my hands on one of these, like when I actually own one of these, one of the vanguards, this will be my definitely my daily for getting around. And I might take it out on ERTs when I get it, too. By the way, the next video, I'm going to finally take on my first ERT. I'm excited for that. We're going to take out the Connie for that one. I feel like I need a bigger ship for a, for a bigger bounty. Because I know what I fight when you fight the uh, Hammerheads. And yeah, so we'll see how that goes. But yeah, it's like... It looks so good, man. Oh, man. Whoa.
Warden. Hurricane. Second one's a hurricane too, isn't it? Third one. Oh, two wardens and a hurricane. Alright, I wanna take out that hurricane first. Oh shit, what the fuck was that? The bounty just exploded! Oh. I know why. There's laser turrets down below. I do gotta practice with cannons a little bit more though. My shields are going down. So I'm going to recharge those really quick. Got a surprise for ya! Oh shit. <laughs> The only downside to having size 2 shields is they take a lot longer to recharge. And I gotta get used to flying something a little bit bigger for combat. I think for cannons you gotta be a little close. Yeah, this fucking hurricane is pissing me off. I'm not used to using like cannons or anything. All my videos, you guys have seen me use repeaters. Let's see how you like this. And oh, I do got some missiles left. I got a little too close. this other fucking vanguard apart. Shit! Whoa, don't get that. Holy shit, what are you doing? Fuck it. Yep. I'm not good with ballistics. Ooh. Down now. 
now, though. I think that was pretty fast, to be honest with you. Yeah, that, uh... That hurricane got a little... Got away from me a little bit there, but, uh... Um... That was pretty fast. Now, granted, the Pavoni, like, got blown up by the turrets. So, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna grab another one. Grab another one. We're gonna stop off. Oh. We're gonna stop off at uh, Port Alisar uh, to. Uh, that's obstructed. Fuck. Yeah, we'll stop off at Port Alisar to rearm, and then I will see you guys on Daymar. All right, guys, we are back. We just jumped out of Quantum to Daymar. Unfortunately, the whole reason why I went back to uh, went to Port Alisar was to rearm my missiles. I got a couple missiles back and top off my uh, my Revenant. And I guess that's a bug too. It wouldn't it wouldn't refill the Revenant. So whatever. We don't need it. I'm in love with this thing. Alright. We're gonna bring our speed down though. Stay in SEM unless we need to absolutely like. Uh, get out of something, but we're gonna prime up our missiles right away. Because if there's a hurricane there, I want to get rid of them as fast as possible. Okay, you know what? Fuck that. We're speeding up. He's definitely a good looking ship, man. Definitely. He's a big girl, too. We got a warden. Gladius. Leave. We got a player on our ass. Yes, we do. So we're going to bolt out here a little bit. So we're not having all that much luck. Oh, 
don't see anything on the radar. So let's take one more bounty, shall we? I know, I ran from a PvP fight. But for ship, I've only flew for about a half an hour. And as somebody who's more used to light fighters, that's not a fight I can win. And honestly, to avoid to avoid any kind of mishaps of eating the uh, the permanent I died like screen, uh, the permanent black screen, it was like you know what. Not today. As much as I want to do PvP, and I really do. But. That turned out to be a little bit of a mess. I'm not gonna lie. Because I couldn't tell who was a player, who was an NPC, where my fucking bounty was. I couldn't tell shit. Where is this fucking guy? Oh, here we are. Take the bounty out first. Got a surprise for you. damage they keep fucking hitting me I'm gonna let them pass down yeah I can already tell though once I get some repeaters on this thing I'm gonna be doing very well with it I just wish my uh, 
ballistic gatling was uh wasn't dry but shit yeah i think you got to be close for cannons Look at that, though. Like, oh my god. That's... It, it's... It blows me away, man. Oh yeah, I took a little bit of damage there. See that? Oh, my door opened. Uh, but yeah, once I'm actually able to own one, get my repeaters, basically fit it out the way I want it to be, it's gonna be a force to be reckoned with, I can already tell. And I see why people love this thing, just with a stock loadout. But, but yeah. Oh man. <sighs> Take one more, one more look around. She's definitely good looking. Even with some fucking battle damage, she's still good looking. But. But alrighty guys, I'm going to wrap this one up here. I hope you guys enjoyed my little my little showcase in the Vanguard Warden. A ship that I cannot wait to own myself. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed, go ahead, leave a like, hit that subscribe button. And if you are new to Star Citizen and you're checking out uh, Star Citizen for the first time, I will leave my, um, my referral code in the description below. That way, if you guys decide to uh, buy into the game and play it for yourself, you start off with a little added bonus using the referral code. So, alrighty guys, I will see you guys in the next video. Alright, have a good one.